Here's your Storm Track 7 forecast. Good afternoon. I'm Storm Track 7 meteorologist Brandon Libby. We have a few scattered showers and maybe a couple of storms left for our southern counties today. Otherwise, skies should become partly cloudy, especially the further north you go. And it's going to be a much cooler rest of this week. High temperatures will drop down into the 70s. Tomorrow, another chance for a few sprinkles in the south. Then we're going to close out the week with sunshine on Thursday and Friday. We have a cold front that's coming through, and most of the rain has been along and south of Highway 30 for a lot of these uh, midday hours, and that will continue into the afternoon. In fact, maybe even becoming more isolated. There may be some redevelopment of storms just off to our south or southeast. Some of those may be on the strong side, but I think those will mostly miss our viewing area. And then there you see the sunshine that pops up in our northern counties. Everybody becomes mostly clear for tonight, and it's going to be a much cooler night as lows drop down to the 50s. And we'll start off with sunshine tomorrow before more clouds will roll in from the west. And there might be a chance for a quick sprinkle there uh, later on in the day tomorrow into tomorrow night. And that's, again, mainly going to be for our southern counties, but really nothing major. Now we're back to that sunshine for Thursday and Friday. Now winds have been a little breezy today. We're going to still talk gusts about 30 miles per hour this afternoon and this evening. But finally, the winds will die down tonight and tomorrow. They'll only be up to about 15 miles per hour. So we'll finally lose those winds. It's been a very windy last few days. And of course, humidity levels are fairly high today, although temperatures aren't that hot. Uh, that humidity is really going down after the cold front passes. So dew points drop down to the mid 40s for Wednesday and Thursday. That's virtually non-existent humidity that will be in the air. So it's going to feel uh, more like spring than summer here to close out the week. Otherwise, we're looking at high temperatures today in the upper 70s to low 80s. It'll depend on the amount of sunshine that we end up getting for this afternoon. And then for tonight, down to the 50s, a good night to shut off the AC, open up the windows, and cool down the house. Here's your city-by-city city forecast. Much cooler tomorrow. Highs will be in the low 70s, then maybe about the low to mid-70s for Thursday, and that's where we stay for Friday as well. And then a more active pattern there for the weekend and next week. Just about daily rain and storm chances, but our temperatures remain on the mild side, about the mid-70s for highs and lows will be in the mid to upper 50s.